Seven, Kiss FM. Seacrest with you. All right. This, if you like chips and salsa, chips and guac, chips, tortillas, if you use them on a regular basis, you may be a purist, but you yeah. also may be looking for a way to enjoy and also cut fat and have them be as healthy as possible. Even taco shells. Wow. I found this brand. I started buying the chips. Then I realized they had tortillas. Then I just realized they had taco shells. Yeah. And I tell everybody about them. It's called Siete. And Veronica Garza from the family that has founded Siete is on the line now. Veronica, it's such a pleasure to meet you. Thanks for coming on. Hi. How are you? I'm great. You've changed my life. I just want you to know. <laughs> you've changed my life. Oh, my gosh. Because a year ago, I discovered your chips. I think I discovered the, the lime flavor. Oh, yeah. And I started to eat them. And I'm like, these are good. How can they be as, as healthy as it says? And so I read the back. And I see a picture of your family and the story of your family. And I just fell more in love with the product. And now, I mean, I take these chips into restaurants and ask for permission to use them instead of the greasy chips. He really does. <laughs> oh, you're better than me. I don't ask permission. I just take You just do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but, but Veronica, I travel with them. Like if I travel somewhere, I take them with me. You bring them on the airplane. I bring them on planes. <laughs> That is so cool. I didn't know that. Oh, yeah. So I'm, happy to hear that. I'm a huge, huge fan and supporter. So, and there's a lot to talk about, but will you sort of sum up the story of your family and how this began for you and why? Yeah. So, um, my family and I started this business in 2014. And really, it came about from um, one product that I had started making really just to solve a problem for myself and my family. Um, I have multiple autoimmune conditions um, that I was diagnosed with when I was 17 years old. On my brother's older brother's recommendation had changed my diet to remove a lot of things um, that were uh, causing inflammation. And so at the time, that meant following a paleo type of diet, mostly mm -hmm. grain-free, but the really cool thing about it that made it easier for me to do was the fact that my whole family started eating that way with me. And so um, I had started experimenting with, you know, using different whole food ingredients to make products that um, I was really missing. Uh, my family and I, at the time, there weren't breads and things that we could buy. So we started using almond flour to um, sure. play around with in the kitchen. But there was still one thing uh, that was just such a staple in our lives and really important to our culture um, that we didn't have and uh, there wasn't any access to, uh, which was a tortilla. So I decided to get in the kitchen and see if I could develop something that was at least reminiscent of a tortilla. Uh, so I just took some almonds and a couple of other ingredients and put them together, used a little tortilla press, and they tried it and they all liked it. And uh, we just started making those on a weekly basis. I pulled my mom in, and she started helping me make batches. And uh, we we finally had something on the table that allowed us to continue eating the foods that we loved, um, but still, you know, maintain the sense of health that that we were loving. Veronica Garza is on the line, and the company's called Siete. The chips are in the grocery store. Mm -hmm. They and I'm. I like to read the ingredients and things too. And I love a snack. I'm a snacky guy. And these are the. I read the ingredients. And I was like, how are these tortilla chips so good? Here's all that's in them: cassava flour, avocado oil, coconut flour, ground chia seed. And that's it. So good. And I don't feel bad after I eat them. They're gluten free. They're grain free. They're paleo. They're vegan friendly. They're made with avocado. Or they're dairy free. They're soy free. There's no corn, wheat, or rice. I mean, come on. <laughs> you. It's like the greatest <laughs> fantasy of all time. Literally. <laughs> I, I I just I'm I'm so happy that you are you, I know you did this for you and the happy that you're sharing it with the rest of us and congratulations I was reading in the news that you guys just got a 90 million dollar investment. We did. Yeah, very exciting. Wow. And you're going to go into are you, us to share our products with more people and uh, solve problems for people beyond my family. 4,000 grocery stores will be carrying it's this incredible. brand. Incredible. Would you ever open a restaurant for us? <laughs> oh, would you would you buy stuff from there? I'll buy the restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> it's on. I mean, that's how much I love it. Um, you're the best, Veronica. I really, really, truly hope to meet you in person someday. Thank you for coming on. 
Thank you. All right. Take care. Appreciate it. Bye. Bye bye. I have to tell you. When I found out she was coming on, I was more excited than almost every star we have on. I know. Because I've been wanting to know. I was thinking about like booking her on a show or doing a series about the family yeah. because it's such a great story. The product is amazing. It's changed yeah. my life. I tell everybody. Mm-hmm. Well, siete, siete. You literally are telling everybody. <laughs> I know. And this is not a commercial. This is like heart love. Heart love. Heart love.